pretty clear sky except for the aluminum haze in the air. Here in Tucson, Arizona, I'll tell you what, you know, reminds me of the past, blue skies. It was common, very common. Anyway, uh, I wanted to share with you guys uh, my new paint job, or my new striping. I striped it just a bit. I, I thought I'd share this with you. Take a look. Let's see what you think of it. Here's, here's my chemtrail van. Apocalypse ready. Okay. How do you think of that, huh? I love the striping. I think it's beautiful. They requested that, uh, since I'm very public and I do things for a large company, uh, then they they said, well, could you keep the writing off your vehicle? Okay, sure. Not a problem. So you're not seeing any writing on there, are you? I see no writing. Okay. She's not quite done yet. I'm going to put a uh, brush guard around the front with a winch on it. But I don't see no writing. You guys, y'all see some writing? I don't see no writing. I don't know. I think I made everyone happy. Got my new light bar on the top. Got my new roof rack. I'm going to put on the, uh, I've got a high lift jack. I'm going to mount on the roof rack. Look at that. I just love that. That's so freaking awesome. Huh? Okay, tell me what you what to think of the Apocalypse Tucson van. You gotta see the inside, boy. That thing is equipped. I got everything from generator, solar panels, uh, all the regular off-road equipment, chains, tire chains, four of them. Got the pull straps, the rope, got in the back got all these cigarette lighter accessories got air pump uh you know you got basically everything just your average stuff you know two jacks high lift jack three spare tires and a pair partridge in a pear tree there we go all right so tell me what you think of the van I'm gonna put I got two more side lights that are just like the little ones that I got on the roof I'm gonna put on the side of the side the roof rack because I actually need them is what I is what I do all the time so got my blue lights underneath it my emergency lights inside the grill because I use those uh, <clears throat> for Mount Lemon and uh, and then uh, the blue lights are incredible the whole van lights up underneath it but I've already been pulled over twice for that so. and my lights I use to get to my driveway they work quite well <laughs> Actually, quite incredible. So, here we are. Real News Tucson reporter Chris Haskell. Let me know what you think of the van. Has it got any information on it? <laughs> hey, did you see the, the, and the striping over here? On, well, on both sides, but you see what it's made up out of? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we did it. Oh, yeah. No, no, no writing here, uh-uh. Yeah. Uh-uh. Yeah, just a little information is all. Your basics. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Little information. Okay, so there we are. You all have a real nice day. Namaste. Got to go to got to go to federal uh, court as a grand juror next week. Wow, guy that they're still looking for, huh? Have a good one. Right over your heads, they're playing God with your air. Power medals. The gentleman tonight who leads the Tucson group. He really believes it. He really does.